Hello, hello, good evening. Hey, good evening. Hey, good evening. How are you? Give me just a second. I'm setting everything here. Hello, good evening. How are you doing? Como están? Fine. Great. That is really, really good to hear. It's a pleasure to be with you. Thank you. Uh, I see we have today Brenda, Luis, uh, Leo Orellana, Sara. So thank you very much for joining. My name is Julia Sarceño. All right. Adriana, also welcome. Um, Inglés Corporativo les da las, las gracias por unirse, por seguir con este proceso, you know en el que vamos a ayudarles a cumplir el sueño de la, esa meta que es bien importante de aprender inglés, all right? So, ¿estamos listos? Yes, yes. Perfect, that's really good, really good to hear. So, los agradecimientos por conectarse, por ahí vi que algunos tenían dificultades con la conexión. No se preocupen si en algún momento, eh, ¿verdad? No, no pueden acceder. Eh, esas clases quedan grabadas, así que nos pueden después revisar, eh, pueden entrar y ver las clases en YouTube, um, pueden revisar el contenido del que se trató y lo más importante es seguir avanzando con la plataforma, right? So, right. vamos a, a dar inicio, all right, we're going to get started. And, uh, just a second here. Ok, so, para comenzar, eh, habemos pocos, así que tenemos la oportunidad de, de presentarnos, de dar un poquito de información personal. So, um, I'm going to say my name, all right? So, my name is Julia, I'm a teacher. What about you? Tell me a little bit about yourselves. Denme un poquito de información personal. Okay. Lo que quieran compartir, all right? Hi Adriana, gracias por compartir el video. All right, there you are. Okay, so Luis, Mr. Molina, le gustaría comenzar. Yes, Carl. No Perfect. Yeah. My name is Luis, Luis Alfredo Molina. Uh, okay. This is my second, my second uh, model, the model here in the English Corporativo. Okay. Um, I am married. I am married. I have three, two boys. Um, I, I, I like the, the English. I Perfect. Like it. Um, okay. My, yeah, my, my interest is to learn English because in, I, I am interested to, to, to find a new job with, 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 uh, I can practice the English way. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Great. That is really nice. Thank you very much. Um, those months, so those voluntarios, voluntarias, anybody else? Yeah. Damos inicio. Brenda, yeah, Brenda, thank you. Yes. Okay, my name is Brenda Mancia. I live with my fa my father and my brother, and I work in uh, Tigual Salvador. Okay. And I'm very happy to be here with all of you, and I want to um, study, and I want to learn uh, English. Okay. And it's 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 really nice to be here. Thank you. Yes, and it's very nice to have you here. So thank you. Okay. Yeah, va a ver que you will make your your dream come true. All right. Thank you very much, Brenda. Okay. Um, okay. One more person: Sarah, Adriana, Natalie, Leticia, Robin. Anybody else? Um, um, good night. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, um, Adriana. Okay. Yes, my name is Adriana. Nice to meet you, uh, bro. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm a teacher too. <laughs> awesome. But, yes, but with kids. Kindergarten. So, yes. Great. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so nice. I want to learn English uh, because it's important in all jobs and with technology and all the time. And I like. Perfect. That is really nice. So thank you very much, Adriana. And uh, yes, you're totally right. English is important to get a new job 
and it is important because it gives you a lot of opportunities, right? To travel, to get a job, to understand other people, and that's very important, all right? So we're going to get started today. Eh, vamos a ir mezclando ahorita inglés español para que vayan también acostumbrándose a um, un poquito de mi voz, all right, a mi acento. Eh, si hay algo que, que de, tienen dudas por ahí, no tengan ninguna pena en hacer las preguntas, right? Uh, recuérdense que tenemos la opción de levantar la mano, all right? So if you have questions, um, you can do that one, you can use it. And also we have a chat. So if you have any question, you can also use uh, the chat section, all right? So, hagamos una prueba here. Um, pueden activar, levantar la mano, please. Just to, to make sure that you got that part. Está en la parte de las opciones. Natalie, you got it, perfect. Sara, okay, thank you. Emerson, you got it. Let me see, let me see. Okay, anybody else? Leticia, all right, very good. Okay, so, ahí está la opción. Uh, Brenda, I see the emoji. Thank you. Okay, good. So, está la opción que dice levantar la mano. That means like, hey, I have a question. I, I want to ask something. Tengo una duda, all right? And uh, por si en algún momento están en silencio, we can uh, use that one, all right? Y no nos hacemos bolas. So, normally, voy a silenciarlos acá, too. Eh, cuando el sonido sea como muy ensordecedor, all right? So, eh, pero veo que la mayoría ya lo tiene en silencio, así que we're good, all right? So, um, okay, I'm going to get started here. Les voy a compartir today's presentation, all right? Give me a second. Okay, so I hope you can see my presentation. This is session number one, free intermediate number three, right? So, we are just one step closer to intermediate. Okay, so this is pretty much, uh, you can see my name here, so I'm Julia, all right? I'll be your teacher, so welcome to this module, all right? And there is something I want to share that is right here, and it says, never stop learning because life never stops teaching, all right, so every day. We have an, um, an opportunity to learn something different, something new, all right? So let's keep um, learning every single day. This is my, uh, the objective for today. So you are going to identify and use some conjunctions. And also we are work, going to work with some adjectives, all right, and adverbs. I'm going to let you know how to use them. So this is the agenda that we have. Uh, first, we had the welcome in. So some of you had the opportunity to introduce yourself. Also, we have a little conversation. Then we're gonna check grammar. Um, and then we're going to have some exercises and speaking time. So you can also, um, you know, practice your English a little bit, okay? So um, who has a checked this um, platform before? Did you have the opportunity to check it? Ya revisaron la plataforma, ya entraron, vieron el contenido. Yes. Yes. Yes, perfect. Yes. Okay, very good. So if you did that, you already saw this conversation, okay? That is a pretty big city. So um, what we're going to do is this. First, I want you to please Repeat after me, okay? So follow the conversation. Then we are going to make some groups. Vamos a unirnos en grupitos y vamos a practicar la conversación, all right? Para que también desarrollemos un poquito de, de lectura, pronunciación, fluidez. So do me a big favor. Si pueden tomar una captura, take a screenshot, all right? If you are in the computer, so print screen. And if you are in your cell phone, um, a screenshot because we are going to use it or you can go to to the platform okay so are we ready please um unmute it okay i want you to activate also the option to talk the microphone so i can also listen to you are we ready yes we're ready okay perfect okay very good so yes repeat after me please 
uh, we have Eric and we have Carmen. So Eric says, so where are you from, Carmen? So oh, where, where are, are you from, from Carmen? Carmen? I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. I am from, from San Juan, Juan Puerto, Rico. Puerto, Rico. Puerto Rico. Wow, I've heard that's a really nice city. Wow, wow. Oh, I've heard that's, that's a really, really nice, nice city. city. Wow. Okay, like, con emoción, right? Like, wow, all right. <laughs> okay, yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah it, it is. is. The weather is great. The, the weather, weather is, is great. great. And there are some fantastic beaches just outside the city. And there are and some there fantastic, are fantastic, fantastic beaches just outside, outside, the, outside the, city. the city. Beaches. 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 One more time. Beaches. 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 There you go. Okay. Is it expensive there? Is, is it expensive, expensive there? there? No, it is not very expensive. No, no, it's not very, very expensive. expensive. Prices are pretty reasonable. Prices, Prices are, are pretty, pretty reasonable. reasonable. How big is the city? How, How big, big, is, big the city? is the city? It's a fairly big city. It's a fairly, it's a fairly, big, fairly big, big city. But it's not too big. But, but it's, it's not, not too big. big. It sounds perfect to me. It sounds, it sounds perfect, perfect, to me. perfect to me. It sounds. It, it sounds. sounds. It sounds perfect sounds. to me. It sounds, it sounds perfect, 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 to me. perfect to me. Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. Maybe yeah, I should, should plan, plan a trip, trip there, there sometime. sometime. Very good. There you got it. Okay. Um, so this is a conversation about this place. All right. So this is about Puerto Rico. Would you like to walk to Puerto Rico? Les gustaría ir? Would you like yes. to? Of <laughs> yes. course. I mean, not now. Okay, not now. In the future. No, exactly. No, no, no. In the future. After it it would be nice. Yes, after the, the COVID, <laughs> when all this, you know, is gone. All right. <laughs> Good. So now, what we are going to do is this. We are going to get in groups, okay, in small groups. So that means you will not be able to listen to me, okay? And uh, I want you to practice the conversation. Practice this to make it um, as natural as possible, okay? So for example, if it says wow, so wow, all right? So try to also uh, exaggerate a little bit. So we will get in groups. Remember, no me van a escuchar, así que no se preocupen, all right? Practice with the person you are uh, there next to, okay? And uh, so, si necesitan ayuda, of course, um, utilizamos el chat, all right? Or take notes y luego les revisamos juntos. Are we ready? Okay. Yes. Ready. Okay, perfect. That's nice. Give me just a second. And uh, here we go. Okay, one, two, and... Okay, here we go. So please, unámonos a las sesiones pequeñitas, all right? And I will be monitoring some of you. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, hello. Uh, something happened here. Just give me a second. The group got is still too big. 
All right. Okay, here we go. Hello, hello, everybody. Um, so let's try to join the small groups. Um, thank you, Zara. Hello. Hi, Sarah. 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 Hello. Hello there. Is, Hello. Is everything good here? Are we good? No, I have a problem with the, the with audio. Sarah. Yeah. I have a problem with the Sarah. Sarah, Miss Cortez, we cannot hear you. Aha, uh -huh, no, no hear. Can you hear? No. Can you can you hear? Yes, I hear you. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, Maybe see. Sarah, no, no hear. Yeah, I guess this is the. Uh, all right. Can you listen to me now? No. Oh, yes. Yeah. yeah, we can hear you now. I will change the audifona. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no problem. That's okay. All right. So, mientras lo, lo, lo corrige, déjeme ir a monitorear cómo van los demás. All right? Okay, okay. okay. Can... Hello. Hello. How are you? <laughs> Hi, <Miss>. Hi. <laughs> I see we practice, but I we can't um, look the picture. Oh, you cannot. Well, I saw that someone shared the picture in the WhatsApp group. So, okay. Yes, you can use it, and I have it here, so you can take a screenshot. Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, give me a second. Thank you. Okay, this is the one. Okay, not a problem. So okay. uh, I didn't listen to Robin. Robin. Mr. Martinez? Hi. Yes. Oh, Ms. I'm Martinez. Rolling. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> okay, no problem. Sorry. Uh, no le escuché antes, so that's why. Okay. Good. So, okay. okay. This is the conversation. Okay. The idea is only to start practicing. Okay. To practice your pronunciation too. And, um, and if you have like an equation about it, I I'm here to help you. Okay, so it, just try to read it. Okay, try to read it. Let me okay. know if any problem. Okay, um, voy a ir a monitorear los demás. All right, so let's try to to practice a little bit. Give me a second. Okay. Hello. hello, hello. How are you doing here? Hi, teacher. <laughs> ¿Cómo les está yendo? Great. Is everything good? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, were you able to talk to Mr. Velasquez? No. So there's no audio for him. Dice que está teniendo problemas con el audio. Ah, okay. No problem. Mm -hmm. That's okay. But he's listening and that is important. Here. Okay. No problem. So the idea is to practice okay. the conversation. Did you practice it? Yes. Yeah. Did you finish? Yes, yes miss. Yeah. What is the pronunciation? The reasonable? Reasonable. Reasonable. Mm -hmm. Reasonable. That means not too expensive, not too cheap. Like 
in the middle, all right? Mm -hmm. So reasonable. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Okay, very good. So give me just like one more minute so every, everybody finishes, okay? And then we will go back to the main session, all right? Okay. So in the meantime, yeah. In the meantime, para que aprovechemos el, tem el tiempo, you know, podemos hacer un cambio, right? If you were reading Eric, you can read Carmen's part. And so you keep on practicing pronunciation. Okay. Okay. Give me a second. Hello. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hello. How are you doing here? Is everything good? Yes. Uh, yeah. Did you practice the conversation? Did you have, do you have any question about it? Yes, we practiced. Oh, did you finish? Yes, yeah. we oh. practiced it two times. Two times, wow, that was fast. Okay, very good, that's okay. So let me finish the station in, okay, let me finish this now. So para que regresemos a la sesión principal, all right? Give me just a second. Hello everyone and welcome back. So I hope you have the opportunity to practice, okay? To, to say hello to, to other people, okay? And to practice the conversation. Let me go back to my uh, presentation here. So we were describing this city, okay? Can you tell me some words that we use to describe the city? For example, this one says, uh, that's a really nice city, all right? So we use nice. Any other The weather word? is great. Perfect, the, the weather is great. Any other? It's not very expensive. It's not very expensive, okay. Any other? Fantastic, fantastic beach just outside the city. Good, fantastic. Any other? It's a fairly big city. Great. Any other? Prices are pretty reasonable. Exactly. So we see this word pretty, all right? Pretty reasonable. Now let's take a look why they are so important. First, we are we are going to describe places, okay? And we need words like nice, big, expensive, reasonable. But we use something that is called an adverb. And in a way, they modify the adjective. All right, they modify the word nice. If I tell you, oh, that's a beautiful place, it's okay. If I tell you, oh, it's hot, it's okay. But if I tell you, for example, oh, it's very hot. So you're modifying, okay, the word a little bit. So they are very important. For example, we have San Juan is really nice. So we are not just saying it's nice, but really nice. We are emphasizing this a little bit, all right? Or it's a really nice city, right? It's not a very expensive. So these words help me in a way because uh, I modify them, okay? Um, you will find in the video, in the platform, something like this. You will find a chart from the most to the least, um, you know, a degree, let's call it that way. So extremely is like the top. Um, and then it comes like a lower and a lower degree, all right? So we have very, really pretty. So pretty, it's not only bonito, but pretty is another way of modifying words. And, and what, what is, sorry, what is fairly? It's pretty similar, you know? Uh, so it, that, this is why they come like in a ranking. So they are just from the most to the least. 
fairly, extremely, very, really. It's, all, it's only a way to say like muy. So extremely, como extremadamente, and then it comes down. So fairly is como muy, you know, but en un nivel mucho más bajo. Pretty much that's the biggest difference. Okay. Are we good? Do you have an equation? Oh. No. 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 Okay, great, because we are going to use them, okay? So I want you to take a look at this. We have here, let's describe the places. So we have these places that I believe you know them, or you have like an idea of the names, all right? And it says here, write a sentence for each of the following pictures using the grammatical structure. What grammatical structure? This one. We are going to use adverbs, like this with adjectives. Adjectives are nice, big, expensive, beautiful, um, small, cold, etc. Okay, words that we used to describe. For example, let's take a look at this place. What is the name? Pizza. What a tower of pizza. Tower pizza tower. Okay, okay, exactly. Very good. What is this place? Ish. El Tunco. El Tunco, tunco. Oh, exactly. El tunco. Tunco exactly. What about this place? Paris Tower. Exactly. It, it is in, in, the, in France, right? So right. what we are going to do is write a sentence. For example, this is um, the Pisa Tower is very beautiful, or oh. very tall, very high, very... So whatever idea comes to your mind, I want you to write a sentence, okay? Or So if you have a pen and, or in a piece of paper, I will give you one or two minutes so you can write them down and then you can share the ex, um, examples. Is that good? Are we good? Okay, yeah. Yes? Okay, perfect. So you have like two minutes. I'm, I'm right here, so if you have questions, please let me know. Okay. Um, let's try to use the structure, all right? So do not forget it. The structure or what we need to use are the words right here.
Do you need more time? Are we about to finish? It's only one, one per picture. Um, only one, I, I think it's fine. But if you want to write more, you know, if you have more ideas, feel free, all right? There's no problem. Okay, let's get it started, all right? Um, let, let's get it started with this one, with this picture. Can you give me uh, some ideas about this one? How can we describe it? Okay. For me, uh, hear me, see? Yeah, 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 I can hear you. Friends, friend, for me, Frank is extremely far away. Ah, okay, okay, but, thank you. But but it's very nice the towel the towel at night ah okay it must be okay thank you very mm -hmm. much mr molina anybody else okay. the water in paris is really nice okay great thank you anybody else paris <laughs> it is an amazing city Okay, an amazing city. Thank you. What about El Tunco? Have you ever gone to El Tunco? Yes. Yeah. Yes? Okay, yeah. so what can you yeah. tell me about the beach? The Tunco Beach is very relaxing. Ah, oh, nice. Okay, okay. Anything else? The Tunco Beach is very crowded. Ah, okay, especially yeah. on vacation, right? Yeah. Uh, in August, then December. Okay, thank you. Anybody else? The Tunku oh. Beach is very hot, but beautiful. Okay, hot but beautiful, thank hot you. Hot but beautiful. You're using but, great job. Very good, Roberto, okay. Yeah. Any other? For me, El Puerto de la Libertad is very beautiful, but the Tunku Beach is crowded at, at the weekend okay okay thank you that's all right what about this one what about the pizza tower okay and um, the pizza tower is pretty weird and has a wonderful history oh, okay the history okay it's very historical thank you very much uh let me see i haven't listened to miss i see you are in huawei p20 but i cannot see your name what's your name Hello. <laughs> uh, so, well, I cannot see some of your uh, names, you know, in the in the pictures. So I'm guessing. I see here we have Leticia, Natalie. Um, I have not listened to. Let me see Doris either. And uh, let me see who else. Roxana, I haven't heard you. And Huawei P20. <laughs> I cannot. Um, See your name, sorry. Okay, so what else can you tell me about this tower? The Tower of Pisa, it's a pretty attraction. Okay, so it's a very um, attractive, did, did you say at attractive, I'm sorry? A pretty attraction. Oh, okay, okay, an attraction, thank you. Okay, very good. So that is the way we use adverbs and adjectives, okay? Now, this is pretty much the grammatical part. Um, you use them very well, so very good job with that. 
And now we have a little bit of a speaking time because it is important too that you talk, all right, that we practice. And what we will do is this. If you can see my screen, you have some places from El Salvador, our country, all right? And this one says, speak in time. In groups, choose one place from El Salvador, like a place you have visited, and describing, describe it using the structure and vocabulary, like expensive, hot, far away, um, beautiful, crowded, you mentioned, right? So let's use a variety of vocabulary. You have volcanoes here, beaches, some uh, touristic places, all right, and places that we are familiar with. So we are going to um, get in groups one more time, okay? And uh, what I want you to do is just choose, like select one specific place from El Salvador. If you want to select a volcano, great. So, and describe it. Oh, it's, um, the weather is extremely cold, for example. Okay, so try to use those, um, that structure as well. Are we ready? Yes. 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 Okay, great. That is really good to hear. So you're ready, okay. So give me just a second. We are going to be working in pairs, okay. So, and then we are going to present. I'm going to choose just two or three people to present, all right. So I'll give you like three minutes. If you have any question, I'm here, okay. So remember, you can use the chat and you will not be able to listen to me, but I will be monitoring, okay. So okay. here we go in one, two, and three. Hello, Doris. Hello. Hello, Miss. I'm sorry, I was late. Oh, no, no, don't worry. You're fine. Thank you for joining. I will be sending you to a group, okay? Please join this yeah. group. Okay. okay, now you can, oh, okay. you can join them. Mr. Velasquez, hello. Can you hear me? Sorry, my, my microphone is too much noise. This, oh, don't uh, where worry. I am. Don't worry, I, I, can, I think I can hear you, but can you hear me well? Yes, I hear you. Oh, okay, okay, very good. So uh, I will ask you to join one of the groups too. Uh, if you have any problems with the microphone, no problem, okay? If you just uh, want to listen to them, it's okay, not a problem. So, okay, now you are ready to join.
Hello, hello. No, I, I don't have no I don't have this information. Do, do you have this no I don't have I don't have let me check. Let me check wait. <clears throat> Hello. Hello. Hi. Is everything fine here? Yeah. Yeah, we will write sentences about the one place of Salvador and then we will explain. Yes, yes, exactly. You are going to not exactly explain, but describe the place. Um, so it, um, if it is possible to choose a place where you have been to, a place you have visited, it would be better, all right? Okay. All right. So, no questions. Everything good. What place did you select? La Puerta, Puerta del Diablo. <laughs> ah, Puerta del Diablo. Okay, okay. Hola, Puerta del Diablo Park. Okay. <laughs> and uh, it is, uh, I think it's not open, right, to the public. I think you can no, go and No, it's a closet, right? Yeah. yeah. A problem in the I future. Suppose, okay. I, I, I suppose the mayor invest in our taxes in there. And well, I just hope... Um, <laughs> You know, when okay. uh, it's ready, so it'll be really beautiful. Okay. Okay. Very good. I'm going to uh, check, you know, how the other groups are, are doing. I'll give you just like four minutes, all right? Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. No problem. Hello. Hello. How, how's everything going so, here? Are we yes. ready? I think we select only one place. Yes, okay. exactly. One place is fine. What place did you select? El Lago de Ilopango. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, are you ready with the description? Mm, I don't know. What do <laughs> <you> <laughs> I mean, yes, it's only one place, right? And uh, so, oh, okay. we gotta describe it. Give me just a second. I will ask you to join uh, the main station. So you can share what you have, okay? Okay, okay. Welcome, Claudia. Welcome. Hello, hello. Uh, all right, you're back. Doris, could you join the group? Could you connect us al final? Could you? Yes. Yeah, okay, very good. I'm glad. Okay. I'm glad you could. All right, thank you everybody for, you know, uh, being back here. The, what is the place you select? I mean, uh, I heard... Diablo. Oh, you were, okay, okay. So that was Puerta del Diablo. I also heard Ilopangos Lake. All right, any other place? Los chorros. Los chorros, thank you. Anybody else? The Tunco Beach, sure. Ah, oh, okay, right. El Tunco, okay, that's okay, perfect. So I would like to listen to um, Los Chorros. Who um, was describing Los Chorros? That was Emerson, anybody else? Only Emerson. Okay, so what can you tell me about los chorros? Okay, and you know, chorros is very, very cold. Okay. The water, the water is very cold. And this is a good place to, to swim in, to swim. Okay. Because the, the swimming pool is very deep. Yeah, okay, very nice. Well, it was, right? <laughs> Like yeah, a couple of days ago. Yes, that's a, what a pity. I know. Okay, okay. Thank you. That was Los Chorros. Any other place? Any other volunteer? We have a couple of minutes uh, left. Thank you, Emerson. That was nice. Anybody else? El Lago de Ilopango. Thank you. Okay. Tell me about Lago de Ilopango. Okay. Um, it's very big, extremely dangerous, I think. 
and it's really cheap that place it's very beautiful yeah, the landscape and it's too deep so is the reason for it's dangerous okay so it is not a good idea to go swimming there okay um uh, there is something you mentioned adriana that is uh, it is cheap i think you said but i thought that ilopangos lake was expensive okay what do you think i don't know tell me please because i um i don't know too much about the place Okay, what, repeat me the question, please. Yes, uh, you mentioned the place is not very expensive, but I yes. thought the place that Ilopangos Lake was expensive. So I don't know, you can tell me. Is Ilopangos okay. Lake expensive? Any idea? Uh, in my case, I've never. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. okay. So I don't know. Yeah, okay, <laughs> no problem. I think, I think um, the people told me the dishes is cheap sometimes. Okay. Are cheap sometimes. Okay. Maybe um, the place where you go, right? Where you go to? Yes. Okay, okay. Oh, I thought <laughs> I thought you had been there. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's okay. No problem. That's okay. All right. Um, so we have just a couple of, of uh, you know minutes left. Um, I don't know if you have like any question. Let me just share here. Um, we have checked. Okay. Um, part of the agenda that we have for today was to check adjectives and adverbs. Okay. Also. Let me see, let me see. The description of places. So you did it, okay, by um, describing some places and using these, ad, um, these adverbs. So I heard some of you saying extremely, very, really, pretty. So remember that this pretty is very similar to very, okay? So you can say very cold, pretty cold. And you're saying exactly, um, uh, the same thing, okay? So we are just adding and modifying the, the adjective, the description a little bit. Okay, um, so um, I don't know if you have like a question, any comments, something that you would like to, to add or uh, one more volunteer? Because also I remember we have a La Puerta del Diablo, if I'm not wrong, some of you were describing the place. So I think that we have a couple of minutes if you would like to share this with us. I have a question. Yeah, tell me, Roxana. Um, with my group, um, have a a dude. I don't know how do you say duda. A doubt or a question? A question. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, because uh, we 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 try to use um. I don't know how do you say empedrado. Like cob, okay. But I can use very cold. Um, that is a specific description because that refers to the um, to the ground. So you can use you can say made of a stone. So for example, the streets are made of a stone. Uh, there, are, there is a specific word uh, to describe it. Uh, I cannot remember, to be honest with you, in this very moment, but I will let you know tomorrow. But um, also you can mention that. You can say the streets are made of, of a stone, and that's okay. But uh, these adjectives are more like to emphasize a little bit, like weather conditions, you know, places, um, and also to describe uh, physically personality, you know, um, well, physically how a person is and also personality, right? So um, I will let you know the word tomorrow. That's my homework for tomorrow, okay? Now, what's your homework for tomorrow, guys? Um, to work a little bit on the platform, okay? Let's try not to, uh, to leave, not to Try not to procrastinate everything uh, to, till the last minute, okay? So 
for example, today we covered station number one. So also go to the to the platform, try to cover station one. If possible, go for station two. And if you have questions, well, we can clarify that tomorrow. And if there's something that you didn't get, you don't have it clear, so we can take you know a couple of seconds to clarify that as well. All right. So um, we are like three minutes, you know, away from the time. I know that the time flies. Time is really limited, you know, but, you know, let's try to take advantage of it. So before letting you go, um, any comment, any question, any, anything that you would like to add? We will have homework. Your for homework <laughs> for tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, of course, of course, Very tomorrow. but your homework is just to work on station number one and station number two of the platform. Everybody has okay. access, right, to the platform. I believe, uh, at least you checked your access. Okay, so that is going to be your homework. If, okay. if you need like more exercises, more grammar, more vocabulary, so with the time I'm going to assign extra, but I was listening to you and, and I think that you're doing a really good job. You speak very nicely. You have a, like a, a good range of vocabulary. So yes, keep working on it, all right? Okay, the, se the section one and two. Section one is, well, we checked exactly what we checked today. Section two also because it's very short <laughs> and there are just two videos. So I think you can make it, all right? Anything else? <coughs> no. Uh, no. Teacher, Hello, you send please. the you send the presentation or emails. Uh, I don't have access to your email, but I can share this in the group if if oh, okay. that's fine. Yeah, I can share this in WhatsApp. But this is exactly the yeah, same that please. is in the platform. I mean, what I have here is what you will find in a different way, but you will find it in the platform. So no worries, me, it's got to be. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay thank everybody. you. No problem. So thank you very much for joining. Los espero mañana. No se me vayan a perder, you know. And remember, um, <laughs> no, you say. Okay. Remember, please, if, si por alguna razón no se pueden conectar, no hay ningún problema. Solamente avanzan más sesiones, all right, para que no nos sintamos tan perdidos y sigamos el ritmo. So, intentemos eh, venir acá, you know, practicar cuantas veces sean, eh, you know, posibles, right? So, yeah. un placer conocerlos, all right, nice meeting you, and see you tomorrow. No se me vayan a perder. See you tomorrow, bye. See you tomorrow, bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Have a good night. Thank you, bye. Thank you.